So we are still in the book, Speak Out Elementary. Now before anything else, I would like to ask you a few questions, right? So don't forget to pause the video so that you will have time to answer my questions. Okay, so question one, do you enjoy shopping? And question two, why or why not? Okay, so after answering those questions, we will now continue with today's chapter. It is 4.4 and the title for this chapter is Favorite Places. Okay, now, so it's about the DVD uh, chapter. So actually, you can search in YouTube. If you want to review about the DVD, you can search Speak Up Elementary DVD Unit 4. Okay, you can see the DVD there and if you have the book with you you can open it up and try to follow us with today's review you can open on page 44 okay so yes let's start yes in your book there's actually the the first part it's 1a DVD review right there are like sentences and it will describe a place or it's actually there uh, in your book, there's, there are pictures, and yes, I told you before, you can watch it on YouTube, so this is very important. But if you don't have YouTube or you don't have the book, uh, we will just practice reading these sentences, okay? So let's start. The first sentence is, it's a romantic city with a lot of art galleries. Okay, so in your book, that is letter... C, okay, that is letter C, all right, I'm going to put here C, and that is in Paris, France, okay, so it's in France, all right, and number two, there are beautiful views of mountains and beaches, okay, so in your book, that is Letter B, okay, letter B, letter B, so that is Cape Town in South Africa, okay, so Cape Town, South Africa, I'm going to put it here, all right, so, and uh, number three, you can visit hundreds of temples and shopping and the nightlife are great. Okay, and the shopping and the nightlife are great. So, in your book, that is, uh, that is Bangkok. Okay, that is letter A. So, A, Bangkok. What country? Thailand. Very good. Okay, Thailand. Okay. Temples and shopping. And the nightlife are great. Mm -hmm. Okay. Number four, the colors are amazing. It's awesome. This is very short, but it's awesome. So if you have watched the video, that is the top one. That is the best place that you need to visit before you die, right? So that is, of course, that is letter E. It's the Grand Canyon, okay, Grand Canyon, that is in the USA, okay, that is this one. All right, number five, it's a fantastic place to watch animals. You can see zebras, elephants, antelope, hippos, and lions, okay. So, of course, that is letter D, okay, that is letter D, and the city name is Masai Mare. Masai Mare. That is in Kenya. Okay. So if you don't know these animals, you can actually uh, search it. Zebras are like donkeys with stripes. Elephants, of course, big elephants with tusk and a trunk. Antelope are the fast animals, like they, they jump or they run with the horns, right? And lions hunt antelopes all the time. Hippos are the big animals with big mouths, right? Okay, 
So let's try to practice reading. You can read with me or actually you can pause the video and uh, try to repeat after me, okay? So let's start. Number one. It's a romantic city with a lot of art galleries. There are beautiful views of mountains and beaches. You can visit hundreds of temples and shopping. And the nightlife are great. The colors are amazing. It's awesome. It's a fantastic place to watch animals. You can see zebras, elephants, antelope, hippos, and lions. Okay, you can pause the video and rewind if you want to practice more in uh, the pronunciation and reading, okay? So let's go to the part two of this chapter. It is speak out a favorite place. So try to tell me your favorite place, all right? So you can actually start uh, with these sentences. For example, I'm going to try to answer these. One of my favorite places is Boracay Islands in the Philippines. Of course, it's in my country, right? I go there every summer. Okay, every summertime, I go to Boracay. When I'm there, I usually swim, uh, do some scuba diving, snorkeling, and other activities. I also eat special food and drink some beer, okay? Alright, so I like it because it's very cool. It's an awesome place. It's a great place. I can uh, enjoy the, the wind. And I can enjoy the beautiful beach and the white sand, okay? It's a great place to relax and to uh, have a vacation. Also, it's a great place to uh, do many activities, okay? So like that, try to make your own a uh, little speech about your favorite place. Okay, you can start with these one. Okay, let's try to practice. One of my favorite places is I go there every Okay, when I'm there, I usually I like it because it's It's a great place to Something okay so yes, that's it for today. Uh, you can pause the video and rewind if you want to review more. But before I let you go, I want to ask you a question. Okay, so if you can go anywhere, where do you want to go? Okay, why or why not? All right, so you can write your answers in the comments below or you can actually tell me your answer personally by visiting us here in Royal English. Okay, again, my name is Mark and I'll see you in the next video. Bye-bye.